Okay, so today I'm going to look at Cubes OS, uh, mainly the, the installation part of it. So Cubes OS is basically a secure and anonymous operating system or a Linux distro. What makes it secure and anonymous is that it runs everything, all the applications and so on, uh, as VMs inside the OS. I think it puts everything in like containers type of VMs. So everything is nicely contained. Anyway, let's, I'm going to create it in Proxmox, but the whole idea of, of cubes is to install it on hardware. So this is just to test it. Let me create a VM. Call it cubes. Ah, come on. Always right, so don't have to change anything there. Uh, no spaces <laughs> next. Right, choose the image you have to upload. Obviously, upload the ISO to Proxmox first to see it here. Choose it there, and then uh, yeah, just that. Leave it default. I'm gonna leave, I'm just gonna choose. Spice and then enable the quick camo agent. Right, I'm gonna leave that as is and then next this size 32. This is just a test, but you might want to make it bigger as you're gonna probably run a lot of stuff on it. Right, so I'm just gonna leave that and then processors at this stage gonna give it two for now but I think four is better right and then RAM I'm gonna give it four as well four gig uh, oh there and there next and then choose your network I run PF sense on VMBR1 so that's why I'm choosing that one but you might just choose VMware, your main internet, virtual power virtualize is fine. I usually switch off the firewall because I have one. And then finished. Right, and then in cubes, where are you? Cubes. Okay, there it is. So in hardware, just check everything is good. So like display basically and then options quema is enabled Ugh, i just enable all of this so that it is there boot order will be fine and then we can boot it up let's start it and then i'm gonna run let's see if spice will work here uh, i can choose to install cube so long Is it this one now? Okay, so let's just wait for it. So uh, we have the normal installation screens here. I just say continue. So it says unsupported hardware, I think. Uh, because it's nested virtualization, I've got a virtual machine running in a virtual machine or something like that. I don't know. Right, choose the installation destination. That that looks fine. Say done. Put in your passphrase for the encryption of course cubes does encrypt the whole disk that's the whole idea okay that's good and then create a uh, user Should be good done done 
and that should uh, yeah begin installation so when I did that in VirtualBox it actually was hanging up there it hanged up Ugh, did it capture my mouse now again <laughs> anyway uh, VirtualBox it hung up where you have to choose the drive and it didn't want to do it so I just installing this now in Proxmox okay let's reboot come on let's go mouse okay let's put in the what do you call it passphrase for for decryption where's my mouse now Right, let's see. Click on Cubes OS. If my mouse will respond. Okay, there it goes. Cubes. And then you can choose the installations. Do you want Debian, Fedora, and Unix installations? So this will basically run the VMs in that uh, specific distribution. They use a combination of, of the lot, so you can just say you don't want Debian for obvious reasons. Then uh, you can just use Fedora and Linux, which I would. Debian is out. Right, and this will be your base, uh, your base distro running the whole show. Right, and then this you can just leave this on uh, on default. Yeah, yeah, just leave it on default, say done, and then finish configuration. Put in your password again, this is your user password. And that is pretty much that, so, yeah, that's cubes, but for some reason, my cubes is not working in proxmox i don't know why so i'm not gonna be bothered like the start menu is not running um and then my as you can see the internet is not working either let's just see if the internet is working but this is weird yeah, it's doing the same thing. So somewhere I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> I have no understanding of cubes really. Do I have to run something else? But the fact that I can't open the start menu is is a problem. So yeah, that's cubes. Good.